of uh, refuge we have here when we worship together is so sacred and special and we will always use this space to remember others and pray for others as well yes yeah, yeah. and it will be extended to others um, I will probably say a little bit more about that at the end but our theme this semester is Jesus the master builder and we are passing the halfway mark and um, I'm happy to call on Sky and Lance. <laughs> I'm thinking of your last name and I'm missing your first name. <laughs> to come and share with us. Please come. And they will introduce what they're saying and a little bit about themselves and uh, tell you more about it. Amen. Good afternoon. So I, we, I thought we'd start with a quick little video just to introduce the, what we're talking about.
So we wanted to just bring that to you. That was from uh, Crane Pelican Ministries, one of the things we're introducing today. But I thought that it illustrated it well that you know we're all working together, and I thought it grew, grew great with our worship today, with God, Jesus being the center um, and you know, building the kingdom, and it's just amazing. So my name is Lance McNeil. I am with the uh, Center for Global Engagement. Uh, this is my wife, Sky McNeil. And, uh, you know, South Florida Bible College students and faculty are participating in God's mission as we fulfill the Great Commission in the power of the Holy Spirit. And that is what we're here to present today. We're uh, presenting a couple things for the student body as potential opportunities to get involved in local, both local ministry and missions and also overseas. So we've got a couple exciting opportunities to present today. Uh, first of all, I'm going to let Sky introduce uh, to you this one from Israel. I need glasses. <laughs> I'm in the over 39 group. <laughs> so the first one we have there, if you'll hit the next slide, it is for Ariel's summer volunteer trip. Uh, this is Volunteer in Israel from July, uh, June 29th to July 22nd. This is three, three and a half week opportunity to go and actually minister with the body of Christ, even though we're not allowed to evangelize during that time, we're gonna be Christ with skin on in Ariel, Israel. To children the ages of seven to 12 years old, uh, we have the cost here, we're gonna have uh, amazing, beautiful uh, flyers that have been put together uh, by Gary and his um, phenomenal partner with uh, graphic design, but it gives you information and we will have this information as well. The first one is the, uh, as you see, the Volunteer in Israel trip. We were going for three and a half weeks together. We get to stay there with a the family uh, during Shabbat, but during the rest of the week, we'll be in dorm-like settings. There are eight positions total, three are already, and we're still looking for those last five. I think we might have a possible two, so we're looking for the rest of our team uh, to head to Israel with us this summer. The next one is the Tel Burner project. Now, Tel Burner is an archeological excavation. So we would get to go there and talk about the moment when we can actually answer questions about Jesus and the Bible and how we live as Christians. There are other universities from around the world that are coming on this project. And the very first week, you get to clear the land. And Nielsi had shared with me that the most exciting moment, she's never talked more about Jesus in the Bible <laughs> at any period of time in her whole life than that week, that first week of excavation. Because there, there were Canadian students and students from around the world, and they said, well, well talk to us about you Christians, and we don't know about this. And she said it was constant. And so this is that moment where we are able to, to give the gospel and to live out in that example and allow them to, to share that, that hope we have in Jesus. And next up, we have Pray and Pelican Ministries. Uh, this is an organization that is doing missions uh, across the United States, also globally. But they currently have a primary real need here locally in the States for this summer. Uh, this is a summer in, uh, assistant position. It's actually paid positions for students. Uh, just need to be over 18. Some of the, um, I don't see the requirements here, but we'll have a documentation that has more requirements and a website. It is paid. Uh, it's for three weeks or less. It's $300 a week for four days. And they are primarily here in, at least this year, it could be Miami, uh, the Gulf Coast, and the Appalachian, but they, there's a number of other places that do. If you go on their website, they actually have been all over the world. We thought this would be a great opportunity to, to go 